Now, so why are we even learning about halogen derivatives? Well, there are actually some practical uses of halogen compounds. Due to the strength of the CX bond, the halogenyl compounds can be very stable, and thus can be used in a wide variety of ways. Halogen compounds are low in toxicity, not very reactive and flammable. Chlorofluorocarbons are a commonly used class of compounds and was used in refrigerants, aerosols, and solvents and propellants. Other classes of compounds like hydrochlorofluorocarbons and bromochlorofluorocarbons are also commonly used. However, there has been some negative environmental impacts. It has been discovered that CFCs interact with the ozone layer that prevents UV rays from reaching the off, and they destroy the ozone particles. UV light in the upper atmosphere splits up the CCL bond and forms CL radicals, which then interact with ozone molecules to form ozone oxygen molecules, thus destroying the ozone layer. A hole was detected in the ozone layer, and nations have come together to sign the Montreal Protocol to limit CFC utilization and production. A viable alternative are compounds containing only CF bonds, since these bonds are much stronger and will not be broken by UV light in the upper atmosphere, and thus no radicals will be formed. The ozone layer has started to repair itself.